Hey everyone, this is James from Fun Foods and today I have another St. Patrick's Day recipe I want to share with you guys and that recipe is for box tea. Now box tea is a potato based cake, like a potato pancake almost. It's a real simple dish to make. There's a lot of steps involved but it's pretty simple to follow along with and I'll show you how to make that in just a few minutes. But I just want to remind you guys that I will be traveling to London and I'll be arriving there on Friday and I'll be there for a whole week. So I urge you to follow my Twitter and my Instagram because I'm going to be updating things constantly on that as well as follow my Facebook. All the links below are in this description below. And you may want to follow my vlog channel which is also listed below in the description. And the reason you want to follow is I'm going to do a special giveaway while I'm over there. And it's only going to be announced on Twitter and Instagram. So if you want your get your hands on some Amazon gift cards, you definitely want to follow me on Twitter and Instagram and maybe Facebook. So I'll see about the Facebook thing. But get your hands on some free cash. So keep watching and I'll show you how to make this recipe. Start by cutting three peeled potatoes into quarters. Place them in a pot and boil them until they are soft. While your other potatoes are boiling, grate three uncooked potatoes. Rinse your shredded potatoes with some cold water. Turn them out onto a clean dishcloth. Wrap up the towel tightly and squeeze out all the liquids. In a large bowl, Whisk two large eggs. Add a pinch of salt and pepper and also nutmeg. Next, add some diced onions. Now just add milk to your cooked potatoes and mash them until they are creamy. Add the shredded potatoes and mix well. Now add two tablespoons of all-purpose flour. Then add your eggs to the mixture. Prepare a frying pan by melting two tablespoons of butter over medium heat. Add about a fourth of a cup of the potato mixture to the pan and cook for about three to four minutes, then flip and cook for another three or four minutes. When they develop a golden brown color, they're ready. When finished, put your box tea on a plate, and this is best served with some scrambled eggs and some corned beef hash. Well, thanks everyone for watching us see how to make this box tea recipe, perfect for St. Patrick's Day, of course. And if you enjoyed this video, please hit that like button below. Also, hit subscribe if you haven't done so already, and you'll see new videos every Sunday at 2 o'clock. I will put videos off to the side that I think you may enjoy. I hope you have a happy St. Patrick's Day. And remember to follow me on Twitter and Instagram because I'll be updating things all next week while I'm in London.